uh, Eric Gettner with Gettner Fisher Farms. We're in Minden City, Michigan, and uh, we've been farming sugar beets for 50 plus years. Uh, last fall, we decided to run one ripper with our 360 bullets and one ripper with an OEM point, and we worked in 20 acre lands to uh, compare to each this spring. And we we're really happy with the results we saw in the spring with uh, thinking between a one to two day quicker dry down in the spring between the bullets versus the OEM points. We are uh, sugar beet, corn, wheat, and dry bean rotation. Sugar beets are planted as early as we can get on the ground, so that one to two day quicker dry down in the spring was phenomenal to be able to get on the heavy clay soils quicker. Sugar beets are a crop that are very hard to get out of the ground. Uh, crusting and uh, water can be a big problem for sugar beets coming out of the ground because the seed is so small and planted at such a shallow depth. So the bolts we've noticed a really better even emergence coming out of the ground and I think that was attributed to the better water, water infiltration into the soil. We, uh, the guys that were running the rippers, I asked them, you know, just keep paying attention, you know, had guys flip tractors, same tractors on the same rippers, just different points. You know, they saw a field difference or a power difference between running them and the guys said they, they saw no real power increase at all and the fuel increase was nominal if any at all. The wear on the ripper points has over exceeded our expectations of what we thought we would get on a point. The, the cast points have wore extremely well, especially in our tough conditions here. 